All right, it's Jens from Shift with Killers from Team Falcons and the player manager as a translator. The only previous time that Team Falcons has made it to the semi-finals was two years ago here in London. The team was an underdog now, but now you're the favorites. Do you feel the pressure? أول مرة في فريق الفالكونز وصل لنصف النهائيات كان برضه في لندن قبل سنتين ووقتها كان يعتبر فريق يعني مو متوقع منه انه يفوز البطولة او يوصل لهذه المرحلة حاليا الفالكونز يعتبر من اقوى الفرق اذا مش اقوى فريق في البطولة هل انت حاسس بالضغط؟ So, no matter what team reaches this stage of the tournament, there's always going to be an element or some sort of pressure, no matter how small, no matter how minuscule. But it's just about how you adapt to that pressure, how you deal with it. As long as you keep on swimming, you keep on practicing, you keep on focusing on what you can do, that's all that matters, and that should be your only focus. All right. You've beaten the top two seeds coming into the tournament, BDS and G2, in the Swiss stage. Who do you think is your greatest threat right now in the tournament? So when you reach this level of the tournament, there's no one team that I'm focused on. We give every team their respect because they managed to reach the stage just like we did. So at the end of the day, we just focus on ourselves and we'll take it from there. All right. You have not lost a series, all tournaments. Are Falcons in the best form of the season right now? Uh, in the middle, first of all, thank God we've been so consistent in our performance and we just keep focusing on ourselves no matter what, we keep practicing as much as we can and we're just taking it one opponent at a time. You've personally played amazing on the field this tournament. What is making you play so well on this land? هلا انت شخصيا يعني ادائك ما شاء الله جبار اسطوري فايش اللي مخليك تلعب بهالقوه وهالجداره على المسرح؟ وزي ما قلت لك شوي يعني كثره الشغلات وكثره الحظ كمان حظ اللعب وقاعد اخذ ثمار التدريب اللي مرت uh, honestly, like I told you before, it's just screaming as much as we can, bot reviewing enemy teams as much as we can, and trying to see what kind of strategies we can adapt to and taking it from there. Alright, and how is it to play with Turk, a legend of the MENA region? Honestly, it, it's an honor and a privilege to play with the GOAT of the MENA region. And that's not to say that you know any of the players that I played with before weren't, the, weren't at the same level. They were all absolutely incredible. All right, thank you very much and good luck tomorrow. Thank you.